We can trace our family history back to 1885 at, in Lambton County. My grandfather was actually born in a house across the road from where we are now, and so, and my dad was actually born in, in the other house that still stands across the road. In the 1930s, and that Thedford bog was drained and, and that to start to grow vegetables, and my grandfather was one of the originators of to start the vegetable farming in this area. George Morris, we'll see, had bought a lot of the bog land and uh, they were growing a lot of vegetables down in there. And Wilford took over from his dad. And then Alan took over from Wilford. My father came up and he started the equipment because they had very little equipment for for the vegetables in that area. And so he, he, he was a major innovator. When they originally started, they were about two and a half acre vegetable farms. And so in order to grow, they had to mechanize. Well, Alan went to uh, agricultural co college in Guelph and he was a pretty sharp young man. And uh, he learned to do a lot of stuff. And then when he come back to the farm, it was not unusual for him to build a wagon, you know, with a welder and all that. He was pretty sharp, and, but Wilford was a hard worker. He made sure everything worked on time. Their main produce was the bog. They had many, many people that worked there from all around the area, from Thetford and uh, Stony Point, the Kettle Point and uh, they employed a lot of people, especially in the celery harvest. I used to be down there when I was just a young kid and watched all the workers. They'd have 20, 30 people there all day cutting and harvesting, and loading the trucks. With the, the farm across the road, which is still in the family, and, and, this, and this property here that we've expanded, so and so we've been farming in this general area here for uh, 100 and, yeah, 135 years. <music>